Hi everybody, this is a video of the Fitzgerald 15 watt T8 fluorescent strip light with a cool daylight T8 fluorescent tube. As you can see, I thought I'd do a video of this Fitzgerald 15 watt uh, strip light with a cool daylight T8 fluorescent tube. And as you can see on it, it says Sylvania Luxline Plus F15 watt slash 865 t uh, slash T8 EAC daylight www.failosylvania.com made in germany and that's what it says on it it says eac and it's got that cross out being on it which you take to the recycling so anyway guys so as you can see now it's uh plug turned on at the socket so all i'm going to do now is turn off this big light now so right that's it now guys the big light's gone out now so on to the the 15 watt da light fluorescent strip light everybody ready after three one two three Oh wow, it certainly did blink happy and as you can see inside I saw the starter glow a very nice orangey colour. Now this one uh, with the cool daylight T8 fluorescent tube at 15 watts shines it shines more daylight and it certainly blinked happy and it, and it followed the magnetic starter but the other one just uh, that I did two days ago was that that normal white one was uh, it just came on instantly without the ballast in it. Well without a starter starting up, sorry about that I mean. Um, all it's doing now, it's just come on nice and cool daylight. And let's take a good look at it before I do anything else. It says Sylvania Lux Line Plus. And yes, and 15 watts and 865, and that says daylight. Which is very nice, cool daylight. And it's so... And it did make a bit of a thuddy noise when it was starting up. But it's... Um, as it was uh, starting to warm up now. It doesn't I don't think this one takes too long to warm up. But I think it's a nice, better one than, than that, that normal white one. The normal white one had that cardboard sleeving on it. But this one's got it as well. But it's... In my bedroom, but as you can see now, the um, the the breakfast tea table, yeah, the strip light on my breakfast tea table is lit in a nice cool daylight colour, and it's lit my breakfast tea table a nice cool daylight colour. So as you can see now, it looks all very nice and daylight all around. I know it looks a bit closed in with all my Christmas trimmings up and everything. It says Merry Christmas, and there's my uh, street light that I made from scratch with the tinsel around it. So. And as, it, and as you can see, and it's lit a very nice cool daylight colour. And when I look all around from my eyes, it shines very nice daylight. Yeah. So, so let's uh, look right into it. It's only got that one type of screw, which that was easy, which I, that undone two days ago. And that was with that, that normal white tube. But now, but now it's the cool daylight one. So, so as you can see now, and uh, I know I've read that thing underneath it, but as you can see on it, it says Fitzgerald that's uh, stickered upside down. It says Fitzgerald Lighting Limited with a CE on it. So, and um, yeah, so I thought I'd do a video of this beautiful Fitzgerald strip light with a cool daylight tube in it. It shines very light, being in a uh, like heavenly glow. I don't know what that thing says on it, why it says on it, um, it says it. Uh, Phalo, I don't know what Phalo Sylvania has got, Phalo has got to do with Sylvania, I just don't know, but the AAC, but it's like, uh, I've seen a lot of those, um, those Fitzgerald strip lights in 15 watts, and they're usually like made for like small cabinets and small kitchen purposes, but funny enough, when I got this uh, strip light, it didn't have a pull cord on it, but I've heard the switch that was separate from the switch that's on the cable, just right here, right next to uh, the Volex one, and they've both got the same principle, so... So as you can see on it, so, and um, and it's lit all my fruits, especially you can see bana my bananas and all my other fruit and everything, so, and that's all it is, and it's um, shining, it's still shining, very nice daylight, it doesn't seem to, it doesn't seem to be any dimmer, it doesn't seem to get any more brighter than that, I think that's as bright as it really gets, and that's all it is, because it's only got 15 watts and what have you, so, and that's all it is, so. So, anyway guys, so as you can see now, the, the strip light, the 15 watt Fitzgerald strip light has uh, reached its full brightness at 15 watts warm and uh, 75 watt, five watts bright and everything guys. So, all I'm going to do now is uh, going to turn it off and turn it back on so as you can see, here we go. Right, it's gone out now, so all I'm going to do now is turn it back on, here we go. Oh wow, well, as I just turned it back on, it just came back on instantly, I thought it would start with a starter. That seems a bit strange that one as one as I turn it off and turn it back on. So, but anyway, it's full back. It's fully back on now, and and like this says on, it's made in Germany, and um, it's because it's been a smaller strip light, and that's why if it if I tried that twenty two starter in it, I think it would just keep blinking forever. Then that's and that's why it looks better with the sixty five watt starter in it. So, and as you can see, when I turn it on, you see it shine orange through this little hole there where my finger's pointing because where I took the screw out. And then, well, you see the light, and that tells you that it's starting up and everything. So, and that's all it is. 
right so anyway guys so as you can see now once again that the Fitzgerald 15 watt uh, T8 fluorescent strip light has reached its full brightness at 15 watts, watts brought warm and everything guys so it's so all about my tongue twist so so it's uh, reached its full brightness and everything so all I'm going to do now is turn off this strip light now so right that's it I'm going to turn this uh, big one back on Right, that's it now, guys. Uh, the uh, the big light's back on now, everybody. So, anyway, guys, uh, this is a video of the, the Fitzgerald T8 15-watt fluorescent strip light and everything, everybody. So, I hope you all enjoyed this video. So, please comment, rate, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching, everybody.